Hi guys, it's Allison Allison and I have a tip for you today that I am really, really excited about. My mom used to always say to me like, why do you get so excited? I don't know, it's just part of my personality and um, I love to tell people about things that I like. <laughs> so here we go. Um, I needed to clean my bathroom a couple of days ago and I ran out of product and I said to myself, I know I've read somewhere that you can use diatomaceous earth in a variety of different ways. Um, I have previously used um, baking soda and vinegar to take care of, you know, a variety of different things in the house. Um, as it relates to cleaning. <laughs> so I said to myself, okay, I'm going to take like three parts diatomaceous earth, one part baking soda, and mix with white vinegar. And I just mixed it to a consistency that I liked, which was kind of like a muddy, a little thickish, muddyish kind of consistency. And I put it all over the tiles in my bathroom. I scrubbed my tub with um, the diatomaceous earth and I decided to leave it for a couple of hours. It was probably about an hour and a half to two hours when I went back. And I just basically rinsed it with the shower head, hot water. And I was really, really shocked. It, w it actually looked like a deep clean. It looked like um, the tub had been bleached, um, which of course it had not been. And it looked like a very like deep clean. And I like it. I am definitely going to use it again. Um, and um, from what I understand, diatomaceous earth has wonderful properties in terms of absorbing odor. So, you know, as it relates to the bathroom, that's a very, very good thing. Um, so why not? I mean, it's all natural. Um, it's cheap. And... Um, it actually works. A lot of times when you're using like all natural, like homemade products, they don't work so good. I was really shocked. I was really shocked. So there we go. I hope you guys um, give it a try to see if you like it. Maybe start small, do a, a, a sink. Oh, and the other thing was that really surprised me. You know, when you're cleaning the faucet heads and stuff like that, that might get kind of foggy with certain products. It was actually like clean and shiny. <laughs> and that shocked me. Not just the tubs and the tiles, but also the metal um, components were shiny. So, wow. There you go. Have a good week. Ciao.